I, I am all for money going to the community. I am for that because that the communities right now are the way they are because of things in the past. But to give out checks to individual people, there's a difference between learning from the past and then still getting caught up in the past. I mean, if, if I had a time machine, I could go back in time when and be like, hey, you never gave us the um, 40 acres of a mule. I would be all for that and I would get on that for the people who were affected and actually went through slavery. But in today's age, like no, no one's experienced it and gone through it. Yes, the communities are um, taking hit by that, but uh, so I mean, I've, I've never. You don't think your ancestors experienced slavery? I, I think they do, but I haven't. I, I've never been in it, so why should I get a check from somebody else who never put it? The, the, it should be, it should, you should be going way, way, like way back. So what about the people who are the descendants of the slave owners who are still reaping the financial benefits of your ancestors? who slaved in those fields for literally generation after generation. You don't think that during that time, your great grandfather could have been building a business that could be flourishing by now, and you would have a multi-million dollar franchise as they do off the backs of others. You don't think that deserves some rectification for you in the present time? I, to, to be honest, like, no, cause I, again, it's something that happened in the past. Again, I've never, I haven't experienced it. I, I'm doing fine right now. I'm doing fine. And I'm not going to be all upset over somebody else's ancestors who I, I don't even know who enslaved my ancestors. I, I, don't, I don't need it. I have no reason to have it. So for me personally, I'm not upset about it, but I do feel my grandfather on his side, they were the first family in the state of Texas to actually file for reparations. And for me, I'm succeeding in spite of that. But to this gentleman's point, when the government says, hey, we're gonna do a thing, obviously the government in itself saw the weight in the air of the wrong, just as the German government did. I think if I wanna buy 90 gold chains, that's my business. I think it would be unfortunate, but I think that if I'm entitled to something, I think it should be in the same fashion that the people of Jewish descent got it. I think it should be in the same fashion that the people uh, that are Japanese descent got it. So you might think it doesn't affect you, but overall I think that uh, we have been greatly impacted by slavery, even up to current. I just choose not to focus on it nonstop so it doesn't become something that holds me back, but I definitely think it's something that we are entitled to. Thank you. Great, guys.